Today I'm going to show you why I love the ribbon in PowerPoint 2007 when I'm using it for rapid e-learning. PowerPoint 2007 introduced a brand new layout uh, with the ribbon and I'll show you what it looked like. It's right up here. And uh, at first um, when I opened it up, this is how I felt. It was really confusing and I kind of hated it at first. But uh, since then, I've come to love it, and I'm going to tell you why now. For me, there are three main reasons to love the ribbon in PowerPoint 2007. The first is the new visual layout, and I'll go over that. Uh, the other is access keys that really cut down time with shortcuts, and the addition of the quick access toolbar. This is what the toolbar looked like in PowerPoint 2003, and it was fine, but it really wasn't that visual. Uh, you just had your menus across the top and drop downs. PowerPoint 2007 changed all that, and let's go ahead and get into uh, PowerPoint 2007 and take a look. So here we are in PowerPoint 2007, and you can see the ribbon along the top here. Um, and what's really great is things are, are very visual and, and grouped together very well. So you can see all these different tabs here as I click through. Um, that opens up different menus. And within each tab you have these groupings where things are in a more logical grouping. Um, within each grouping there are different commands. And that's what uh, Microsoft calls these are commands uh, that perform a certain function. And I think it's a big improvement over PowerPoint 2003. Another big advantage in PowerPoint 2007 is the way that the shortcuts work. Now if you're familiar with how it worked in 2003, you could hit the Alt button um, and then you could see each one of these has an underline. Um, so if you hit E, you'd open up the Edit menu. Um, and then if you hit F, which is underlined here, then you'd go to Find. Um, but it was kind of hard to see and not everything had um, keys attached to it. Now let's look at how that is in PowerPoint 2007. In PowerPoint 2007, those hotkeys are hot. Let's go ahead and get into the program. I have PowerPoint 2007 and open, and you can really access the quick access, or sorry, the uh, ribbon very well when you hit Alt. So if you hit Alt, it opens up what Microsoft calls uh, access keys. So when I hit Alt, you'll see there's an H here, an N there, a G there. Um, and if I hit one of those buttons, that key, so let's say N, which you'll see up by insert, that opens my insert tab. And now I have letters attached to all the different commands. So, for example, if I wanted to insert a picture now, I would hit P. And it performs that function for me, so I could just drop an image in there. And there we go. Or if I wanted to do a text box, I could hit Alt to activate the access keys and to insert. And you see that now the text box is X, so I hit X. And now I can just do a text box there. So that really just makes um, the, the shortcuts a lot easier to navigate. You can see it all out, and it's all laid out there for you. The third thing that I really like about the PowerPoint 2007 ribbon is the quick access toolbar. You probably haven't even formatted that on yours. Um, I have mine below the ribbon. It may also be above, and it comes by default with just a few settings. So you'd have save, undo, and redo. But you can put any commands in there that you want, and I like to put the ones in there that aren't readily available but that I use all the time. So I have things like um, alignment, distribution, working with layers, working with fonts, working with shapes, and then a few others that I use frequently. They're all out there on the ribbon, but these are ones that I use a lot and uh, I like to have quick access to them. The other nice thing is you can activate them as well by hitting Alt. So again, in PowerPoint, if I hit Alt, you'll see that it activates shortcuts for the quick access toolbar. I'll go into more detail in the next lesson and show you how to set up your quick access toolbar and how some of those features actually work. I have a few other lessons that are out or will be coming out about PowerPoint, um, so stay tuned for those. Thanks a lot for your time. I hope you enjoy these lessons.